Hello, welcome to the OpenGL projects. In this video, we are going to show you 3D bouncing balls. Execute the program. You can see three different balls bouncing on the floor. The floor is a checkerboard. You can clearly see the three balls of different colors bouncing on the floor. Now, see the user interaction with the up key. Okay. It will zoom out and with the down key it will come forward or zoom in and so with the right key it will move in right direction and left key move in left direction simultaneously you can use all the four navigation key to uh, do whatever the action they are performing let's do some modification in this program so you can understand better uh, th this section define this uh, variable uh, sorry array will define the color okay so this white denote the white color red and uh, green and magenta so as you s have seen the checkerboard I uh, is of red and white strips okay let's change this I will not change the name so RGP so let's make it green and execute so checkerboard converted to green and white strips so let's go back to the original and you you have seen see the i will change the green ball into the red ball okay so let's uh, so it's clear here the green one has changed to red one this one next uh, i will show you the see uh, this this function uh, the ball here here the first uh, is the radius second the color and these are x y z coordinates so first i will the white ball which is uh, leave that i will give this one change i will change this one uh, 0.5 so the radius is will become small so you can see clearly see that okay uh, let's go back to the original 1.5 uh, rest I will show you one more thing this is the the key function which we have used for user interaction that is left right up down key so we can uh, you can also use the other key like W Q E R S T whatever uh, okay but for that you have to implement uh, another key function I have with me I will use it I guess go back to the program and let's paste it here and similarly call back it in the main program let's see here so mirror you have to declare the exit so here we we'll just include stidlib dot h okay uh, because uh, I have called this case q which will exit the program now execute it you a, a so it's moving in left direction b right direction w so it's going down means zoom out and s so zoom in and let's space press the q so it will exit
the three i have shown you the demo with the three modifications thank you for watching have a nice day